Okay, gang, this is going to be an attempt to work through the 6-4 homework. Lots of people having problems, and I think this might be the best way to handle it since we're towards the end of the semester. I'm going to try to work through some of these, and this may be a little sketchy as I go through, but um, we're going to spend some time just going through these. Now, the problems that I have may not be exactly what you have, because with everybody's assignment, uh, they could be in a different order. And, for example, the numbers that are inside here might be different. But I think going through this, you'll still see the same concept. Okay, so we want to find each of these probabilities given the Venn diagram. This is the probability of E. Now, E is the circle on the left, which would be the sum of these two here. So that'd be 0.2 plus 0.5. That's going to be 0.7. It's not just the 0.2, it's 0.7. The probability of F would be the sum of those two, so that's going to be 0.6. Then the probability of E given F, that means we're inside this circle here. And those that are E would be 0.5. So that's 0.5 out of 0.6, or just 5, over 6 is a fraction. Now this says it's an integer or a decimal, so if we wrote that as a decimal, then that's going to be, I'm going to put it over here, 0.83. And then the last one says, what's the probability it's an F given E? Now we're given these two. So that's 0.7 altogether. 0.5 out of 0.7, or 5 over 7. Or is a decimal? These are not good decimals because they, they're repeating. So I'm going to put 0.71. When you enter these, it says enter as an integer or decimal rounded to two decimal places. Okay, so it says two. That's good. I, I didn't see the two decimal places. But again, if you, as you go through these, write your work down, put everything on a sheet of paper and send that to me, and then I'll be able to, to check those for you. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> 